everyone, and welcome back to the second part of my parency challenge. Um, so we are currently here with Callie. Um, this is her very first day of work. I went ahead and put her in the medical, in the doctor career. So currently she's a level one. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and let's head inside. So one of the first things that we need to do is greet two co-workers. So I think, yeah, so Bridget is one of them. Let's go give her a friendly introduction. Um, there she is, okay. I was like, where did she go? And then, who is this? Tanya. We're gonna go ahead and also give her a friendly introduction. And in order for me to get promoted, I need to attend an active work day at the doctor career venue um, at least twice. So. Um, let's go ahead and ask about Bridget's day. Um, let's get to know her. Let's find out how she likes working at the hospital. Ooh, I've never seen this one before. The gossip about office romances. Um, and then... Where is... We don't need to ask about her salary. That's a little... A little bold on the first on the first day of work. Um, I'm not seeing where... So we'll come back to her later. Um, let's head over this way. And so one of the things that we need to do is deliver food to a patient on an exam bed. So let's... Who is this? Luna. We'll go ahead and bring her some food. I haven't really played too much in the doctor career when Get to Work came out. Um, it's more of one of those things where I started playing it, however, I never got a chance to... I never got high enough in the careers to actually know where it goes. Usually I always end up starting like a new game or just switching careers or not even bothering with any of the get to work careers so I'm definitely excited to go ahead and play it a little bit let's go ahead and grab a snack um let's do a pastry so after her shift today let me see she might go ahead and hit the town just to see, meet some people, find out who's out there, um, get to know some people, and hopefully find us a baby daddy um, because we do need to, we do need to find a, a baby daddy to get us pregnant in order to start the next generation of this let's play well after after we kill him off of course okay guys um Callie has just ended her shift we earned ourselves hundred and forty four dollars today we're gonna head home um, get her needs up and then I'm gonna see if I can invite Luna out and maybe we can go to Del Sol Valley, or maybe even, maybe, maybe Brightchester. Okay, so she's all energized. Let's go see um, what needs. Let's go up and let's go hop in the shower. Let's take a quick shower. Um, we're going to use the bathroom really quick, and then we can come down and... I should have, yeah, we're gonna get some leftovers. Oh. And then hopefully that should. Ooh, 
she actually put on a cute outfit. So we're going to go down and eat. I think this is mac and cheese that she cooked the day before. So I ended up getting rid of her TV that was on this wall and putting art there just because when I would tell her to go make food when I was playing off screen, she would stop in the middle of making food and she would go and start watching TV and she would literally starve herself to death just so that she, just so that she could watch TV. I feel like she knows what's about to happen. I feel like she's, oh, she's done eating. Okay. So let's go ahead and we're going to clean this up. Um, but yeah, I feel like she knows that she's about to go out, she's getting pumped, she's like ready, looking cute in her little blazer, and her little pink shoes, and she knows that she is about to go out and meet herself a man tonight. So let's travel. Um, will it let me... Yes, there she is. <laughs> I like how I've been calling her Luna this entire time, instead of Tanya. Could have swore that her name was Luna, but okay. So we're gonna invite Tanya out. She should be off of work. And we are going to, let's stay local. Let's go ahead and, let's, we're not gonna do coffee. Um, I guess let's go to the bar. Or actually, let's go to the nightclub because who does not want to pick a man up at a nightclub on a it's probably Monday night okay so six o'clock well okay seven o'clock on a Monday night let's see if Hopefully the club will pick up. I like how Weston is over here just getting it and there's nobody in here. Um, who is this? Let's let's go here. Let's go here together. Who are you? Are you is are you land grab? You are. Geoffrey Land Grab, maybe? Let's go ahead and let's give him a friendly introduction because maybe he is a little older maybe I can be his his little mistress on the side oh wait whoa 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 um actually Joaquin oh Let's go ahead and let's slide right over to Hakeem and let's see, forget Jeffrey or Geoffrey, however you say his name. Let's forget him and let's go focus on us some Hakeem. I think that's how you say his name. Oh, he's coming to us. Come on, just stop talking to him already. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's give him a heartfelt compliment. Be like, you look like you're a really sweet guy and I want to get to know you. And I want to get to know you. Um, I wish I could get, how do you, I don't want to talk to him anymore. I just want to talk to Hakeem. Um, let's go ahead and distress, discuss our interests. We're going to add him to our group really quick, just so I can keep track of him. Looks like he has some good dance moves. Um, let's brighten his day. You know, I think we might have to move. Um, let's go... Let's go up here and sit, because... Joffrey won't leave me alone and he keeps trying to talk to me so I'm like maybe if we all head up here I like how I haven't said anything to Tanya I'm hoping that Tanya does not sit here okay perfect she does not come on sit down sit down sit down okay so 
Um, let's get to know him a little bit. Let's see if you got some of that prime baby making skills. Um, let's ask about his career because we definitely want somebody that is something good. Um, let's go ahead and discuss some neighborhood changes, see how he likes it out here because you know we're new to town. Um, let's gossip a little bit. Um, let's see. What else can we do? Let's ask about his day. Let's see how that went. Because so far since we met him, our day is going good. Let's discuss some interests some more. So... Is there a celebrity here? Oh, I guess there's celebrities here. I'm gonna give him a heartfelt compliment. I don't know why Marcus is in this conversation right now. He's like talking to us from across. Ooh, maybe Tanya's get trying to get some. I don't know what's going on with her shoes though. Like, I don't understand. I don't understand why she has those shoes on with her outfit that she has on. No, 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 Hakeem, come back, come back, come back, no. Um, hold on, hold on, um, let's, let's brighten his day. Can we, can we, do, ooh, let's go dance together after this, since the DJ has started to back up. Let's go break down some moves, possibly. Does Dan- I wonder if dancing together raises, like, friendship level. Like, I don't think it does. I think it just does the dancing skill. Um, are we able to still talk to him? Let's ask about his career. I don't think... So all we know about him so far is that he's a music lover. That's pretty much it. And he's our neighbor. So I, I wonder where he lives. Oh, do you see this picture of him? Oh my gosh. He looks like the total hipster. Um, let's go ahead and tell a joke about some aliens, if it will let us. You know, we have... Let's go ahead and... Let's stop dancing now. Um, let's go ahead and... I'm not sure why I won't let me do anything romantic. Um, let's go ahead. It's already 11, so we are going to... Maybe if we travel with him somewhere else maybe to like a nice little secluded place somewhere we can get to know him like you know maybe like the coffee house so we're gonna head over to the hare and hedgehog cafe oh here it is Like, it looks really dark in here. Okay, so let's, we don't have to order coffee. Let's, uh, let's sit outside. So let's go sit, sit here together. We can get a little bit intimate. Wait, 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 where are you going? I feel like this isn't going to work. Um, okay, let's get to know him some more. Because right now we only know that I don't even remember what we know.
So he's outgoing. Let's tell him a dramatic story about, like, I don't know, about how we stepped in gum one day. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead. Let's ask him about his career because that's definitely important if we're going to need some child support after this challenge. Um, let's tell him an engaging story. Let's tell him, like, about our move here and... We're gonna brighten his day a little bit. Did they tell me what his... So... He's an open mic seeker at Limelight. Okay, that, that could possibly work. Um, let's go ahead and we're gonna complain about that nasty ass fruit cake that the land grabs brought over. And then I think maybe we can go ahead, let's, let's find out if he's single. He keeps trying to order something. Let's have a deep conversation. Let's be like, what's your goals in life? I know this is like the first time that I met you, but I need you to spill all the tea. And then let's go ahead and compliment his appearance. See how, you know, see how he's liking that. Like, I love your clothes and your little pants that make it look like you're wearing a diaper. Um, and then let's flirt with him a little bit. Who is this that's all up in my face? Um, let's go ahead and let's give ourselves a friendly introduction. Oh, so he likes that, huh? Did he like that? Hold on. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's, let's confess some attraction. Be like, you're cute, I'm cute. Why not let two cute people get together and maybe make some magic? Let's flirt, flirt with him a little bit more. Why is this not... Why is she not listening to me? Why does she not want to... Okay, let's exchange phone numbers. Be like, here's my number. You take my number, I'll take your number. And maybe like, okay, we don't need to be doing the whole kissing the phone thing. Oh, okay. Okay, so he's, he's liking it. There we go. So she's all confident, <laughs> totally digging me. Um, let's go ahead and propose this crazy scheme to him, like, like a date night. Let's give him a bold pickup line. Um, and then let's let's blow him a kiss. And we're gonna say goodnight to him because it's already two in the morning. Um, she has to go to work in five hours, so we need to head home. I feel like Hakeem is gonna go ahead and be our baby daddy. So let's go ahead. We're gonna travel without him. And we're gonna head back home. Okay, so let's we're gonna go ahead. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and have her use the bathroom and get herself situated, and I will come back for the next morning. Okay, so I went ahead and was playing off screen for a little bit just to get her through her next day of work and we were catching up on her sleep and we just got a phone call when we picked it up. Turns out that it is Hakeem and he's like, there's a rumor going around that a crazy party is happening at the chalet right now. Care to join me? So evidently he's digging us. So. Of course we're gonna say yeah so we're gonna head over to I think it was the 
Von Haunt Estates to go hang out with Hakeem, maybe, you know, get a little bit closer and see where it's gonna take us. Okay, so we're here. Um, because I was catching up on sleep, um, I did not get a chance to eat. I think last time I've come to one of these, yeah, they set up back here. So we're gonna go here together. I'm gonna grab, um, let's grab a, um, a pretzel just to fill us up really quick. The last time I came here, when I was playing with another one of my sims, it ended up being rainy weather, so none of the equipment in the back worked. Um, let's go ahead and we are going to dance together, just so that we can get some of our fun up. She doesn't have work for the next two days, so I, I'm i gonna probably spend that time with Hakeem, getting to know him, and just, you know, she needs to hurry up and finish this pretzel. Like, how long does it take, how long does it really take to eat a pretzel? Like, what, it's like a couple bot bites? Oh, it looks like everybody is frozen. Everybody's unfrozen now. So she's gonna hurry up and eat her pretzel in like the next second so that we can then dance together. Okay, you're done with your pretzel because you're taking too long. By the time, like, how does it take you half a party to eat one pretzel? Okay, so she's gonna go ahead and dance a little bit. Well, that sucks. She just got bored. Who? Who's DJing? Oh, it's little grandma being a DJ. Ahana. Uh -huh. I guess Callie is really critical because she is not feeling it right now. how bored we are. And then let's go ahead and tell him about like this crazy outrageous party that we went to like a couple years ago and it just ended like terribly bad. Let's suggest some fun activities of like what we can go and do instead of being here or even just like on the next couple days. Let's get to know him a little bit more, find out what things that he likes to do besides DJing and dancing. Uh, let's go ahead and let's give him a hug. Let's be like, hey, thanks for inviting us out here. a little bit. Um, let's see if 
Let's start with them a little bit more. It hasn't give, given us the mood lit yet where we can get a little smooches on. Let's flirt a little bit more. And then we're going to do their first I feel like she's had this outfit on for a while. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. There's a green light in his face. I gotta get a good ooh, angle. Oh no, what happened? No, okay. Gotta get a good angle for this. Ah. So the party's about to end, so I think it's only right to go ahead and leave this part here and make this the end of this episode. So I will see you guys in the next part.